meal. There are so many easy recipes I have developed that you can prepare in no time. And uh, today's recipe I'm going to prepare is um, mixed vegetable cakes or you can say puras, chilas. To prepare mixed vegetable savory cake also known as chilas. Into the mixing bowl I'm going to take half cup of new milk complete protein. To that, pinch of turmeric powder, cumin seeds, salt to taste, little bit of black pepper. I like to make recipes kind of spicier, but it's totally up to you. So just a little bit of black pepper. Give all these dry ingredients a good mix. I have one more dry ingredient, baking soda, which is optional, but I kind of like to add to make uh, this vegetable cakes kind of little fluffier. So I'm going to add that last before I start making the cakes. All right. Next, I have all the vegetables here, onion and tomato carrot and bell pepper. Vegetables can be totally your choice. Coriander leaves, minced ginger and green chili, about teaspoon of oil and I am making this recipe vegan and gluten free but if you are following vegetarian diet yogurt can be added as well. Uh, and you can simply leave out oil uh, from this recipe if desired um, but I am just going to go ahead and add everything I just want to make sure that I haven't forgotten anything so now let's mix it I love how colorful it looks with all the colorful vegetables cabbage zucchini there are endless possibilities um, for the vegetables so you can just uh, Come up with your own favorite vegetables to add in this recipe. And now I'm going to add little water at a time and prepare thick batter and not thin batter because vegetables will release water. So be sure to count that factor. Especially um, I have added tomatoes. So I just want to make sure that I do not add too much of water. If I need more water, I can always add later. Alright, so this is it. It took about like a quarter cup of water for half cup of uh, flour. So I'm just going to now let it rest for about 5 minutes. So here I have the, uh, the mixture ready and uh, now I'm going to make the cake. For making the cakes, I'm just going to use this, uh, you know, mini treat uh, pancake maker. I simply love this uh, pan and um, it helps me to prepare, you know, kind of a good looking <laughs> uh, recipe. Instead of like making something bigger, I always love to prepare like a cute small things. So now let's make the cakes. Mmm, smells good. Alright, so the batter has been resting for more than five minutes now and i'm going to add uh, just a pinch of baking soda because it's just a half cup of flour so very little amount so baking soda is going to be just a pinch and i'm also going to sprinkle a little bit of water again all right so let's start making the cakes actually it's a pura we indian call it Pura, chilas. Heat up the pan on a medium to high heat in the beginning and once the um, pan is kind of a little bit hot just um, reduce the heat uh, on a low to medium because we want to cook our cakes really well and I am going to grease the pan with a um, drop of oil. Just spread the oil and I'm using this um, ice cream scoop, one tablespoon ice cream scoop to make the cakes even. And then just spread evenly. 
If you like crispy um, cakes, then uh, spread thin. But I like mine like a little soft inside and crispy on the outside. Look how good it looks already. Making savory cakes is one of my favorite thing to cook because it's quick, easy, and you can prepare healthy. One of my all-time favorite is uh, zucchini cakes. Now, just a little bit of oil on the top as well. So when I flip the puras, the other side gets kind of crunchy as well. And um, I have the temperature on a low right now because I want to cook them really nice. Uh, till golden brown. When the top um, looks little cooked, uh, try and see if the bottom is done. Um, it's almost kind of done. So I'm going to flip and cook now on the other side. So I love this. Now as you can see, nice beautiful golden brown color. But if desired, you can cook a little bit longer for the crispiest texture. And I'm okay with even dark brown. So the bottom, actually, I am going to cook until it's nice and brown. All right, so now let this cook. All right, let's check the bottom. As you can see, I allowed it to cook to nice golden uh, brown, actually a little dark brown, not golden brown color. So that is how I like them. And uh, actually, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, cook again the other side just a little bit. But I'm going to turn off the stove since the pan is uh, hot enough to um, cook the other side. It's better to turn off the stove because you don't want to burn them. When ready to take out, take them out onto the paper towel. Look at this. All right, so here I have all the vegetable cakes ready. Let's bring it onto the serving plate or you can serve on the board like this. They fit perfectly. Look at this. This basically is like your vegan omelette, dose of vegan omelette. Um, and let's taste it. Mm. It just feels like how I eat my traditional recipe known as puras, chilas, but kind of a little bit more healthier. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video and we are going to have ongoing collaboration with Dr. Kalpana Ramji on different topics. So feel free to ask any questions you have and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for new recipes and uh, um, topics um, every week. Uh, you can visit my website baunaskitchen.com for new recipe tips, tricks and ideas in the kitchen. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, TikTok, Baunas Kitchen is everywhere. You can download Baunas Kitchen app totally free on your iOS, Android and many other mobile devices. You can watch me on a big TV screen using Roku, Amazon Fire or YouTube app itself. Thanks for watching and see you soon.